A glove's job is to protect a worker's hand from the hazards of work, including sharp objects. Protection needs vary according to the job. For example, in packaging or warehousing, workers need only light cut protection. Working with blades and saws, glass manufacturing, or metal fabrication demands heavy-duty cut protection. The level of cut protection is determined by the type of fibers in the shell of the glove and the thickness or weight of that material. What's the key? Matching the right level of cut protection to the job. I'm Ann Thurman, Director of Product Development at Westchester Protective Gear. I'm here to help you find the right level of cut protection. There are two standards that can help guide you in this decision. In the U.S., the preferred standard is the ANSI 105 for Hand Protection Classification, which is developed by the International Safety Equipment Association, or ISEA. The ANSI standards are about comprehensive hand protection. What we are talking about today is the ANSI standard for cut resistance, which was revised in February 2016. It now rates cut resistance on a scale of A1 to A9, where A1 is the lowest level and A9 is the highest level. A swatch of fabric is cut from the palm of the glove and placed on the TDM100. The machine then runs a straight edge razor blade across the fabric. The blade is attached to a weight at the top and measures the pressure applied in grams. The weight continues to be increased, adding pressure to the blade until it finally cuts through the fabric. As you can see from this chart, the A1 through A9 ratings are assigned based on how many grams of pressure were needed to cut the fabric. We call these gram scores. There are at least three passes of the blade at every weight, and these are averaged to get the gram score. What's the difference between the new and the old ANSI scores? There are now nine cut levels instead of five. Previously, level four was very broad, ranging from 1,500 to 3,499 grams. Now, three new levels have replaced level four to provide better granularity. In addition, the old scores maxed out at 3,500 grams. Now, the upper levels have been expanded and the new maximum score is 6,000 grams. This increased gradation helps you make distinctions that previously didn't exist, so you can make a more informed decision. Europe and other countries around the world rely on the EN388 standard. It rates cut resistance on a scale of 0 to 5. The test results are compared to the cut results of a standard cotton canvas. A cut level of 5 means that it is 5 times more cut resistant than the reference cotton. As you take into consideration the level of cut resistance needed for your job, remember, not every job requires a high cut score. Here at Westchester Protective Gear, we are constantly researching engineered yarns and new materials to bring you improved and better products.